Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're talking about dog's poop. As a owner, you need a checking your dog's poop daily. Sounds crazy, but it's very important. I, during these seven years with my dog, Candy, my husband and I verified the poop of Candy from the color, shape, consistency, or in some cases, the smell. Basically, you have to know are these points. Number one, dog diarrhea or watery are an indicator of intestinal discomfort. It can be a sign that something is wrong with your dog's belly. Number two, if your dog's poop is hard or dry, it could be a sign of constipation. Number three, if your dog's poop is sticky and slimy, mucus, this is probably an indication of an inflammation problem in your dog's large intestine. Number four, if the poop is greasy, it indicates excess fat in your dog's diet. Number five, if the poop is smelly, there are many causes, worms, parasites, bacteria, viral infection, irritable bubble syndrome, food allergy, consumption of a foreign object, inflammation of the colon, inflammation of the pancreas, and malabsorption. Not all causes can be solved with natural remedies, and your pet may require medical treatment, so always consult with your pet if you notice your dog's book strange. And the dog's poop doesn't smell bad for a homemade diet. Or, as you're saying all the time, when dogs eat human food. And remember, processed food, kibbles or wet food for dogs, contains ingredients such as vegetables, fruits, grains, animal protein, etc. The same food that humans. Okay, guys, remember, the consistency of poop can vary according to the diet of your animal. A healthy poop is generally easy to identify. It's a segmented, slightly damp, chocolate brown in color, firm with a mild odor. If a dog produces large amounts of poop and is remarkably stinky, probably it's about the kibble diet. Now we're talking about the color of your dog's poop. Number one, white poop have a lot to do with calcium intake, most likely originating from being given raw or cooked bones or raw animal protein. Number two, yellow poop, typically means bile, from food intolerance or food allergy. Number three, orange and green poop, most likely from food rather than a medical issue. Has your dog eaten carrots lately? Or a perfast has been sneaking on a lot of rats? No? So I think it's time to make an appointment with your vet to explore the chance of a liver issue. Number four, speckled poop. That is a dog poop with white and tan specked in it. Marks the existence of worms. Yes many dangerous parasites like around the worms and table worms may be present in your dog's poop and remember table worms will look like a small white segment similar to grain of white rice while round worms resemble the look of earth worms dogs typically get worms when buying by a flea, make sure to take your pup to the bed to get dewormed or buy some flea preventive. Number five, bread poop may indicate blood in the stool, probably due to bleeding in the lower intestine. There could be a perforation of the intestinal wall from something the dog eat or from the eruption of a tumor or ulcer. Please go to the bed. Number six, black poop can be a real cause for concern. 
This extremely hints in bleeding in the upper intestine. The bleeding could be caused by parasites, infections, allergies, polyps, cancer, or having ingested something sharp. When this color is detected, take your dog to the bed immediately. Guys, I hope you like this video. If yes, please subscribe to my channel thumbs up we have videos about dogs every saturday and i have recipes for you every wednesdays stay tuned and follow me on my social media see you next time bye bye